that we should know what is the prevalence incidence of hyperthyroidism in a pregnancy. Two out of thousand pregnancies can have a overt hyperthyroidism and there can be a mild or a subclinical alteration in the thyroid functions up to 2% of the pregnancies. The commonest cause for hyperthyroidism in a pregnancy remains Graves disease followed by toxic multinodular goiter, toxic adenoma and also rarely patient can have a HCG associated transient thyrotoxicosis, TSH dependent thyrotoxicosis and iodine induced hyperthyroidism. The overview of a Graves disease which is the commonest in the pregnancy, very rarely we may see patient having both hyperthyroidism, ophthalmopathy and a pre-tibiate mix edema. Very difficult to uh, differentiate if the above features are not there because it is difficult to differentiate from the normal pregnancy manifestation. Presence of thyroid peroxidase antibodies, thyroid receptor, uh, receptor antibodies are increased in most patients with Graves disease that makes diagnosis easy in some cases of confusing th thyroid function reports. The effect of pregnancy on the Graves disease is different. In the first half, there will be an increase uh, uh, incidence of the thyrotoxicosis which improves in the later half of the pregnancy because of immunosuppression. The symptoms gets aggravated during the first half because there is a simultaneous production of a HCG from the, uh, from the pregnant woman. Postpartum the symptoms increase due to taking up of the immunosuppression and sudden rebound increase in the uh, autoimmunity and increased uh, uh, prevalence of even a postpartum thyroiditis and a Graves disease.